is happening today, we are at Kelaverock Castle. This is actually a castle that's surrounded by a moat. It looked very cool from the pictures we've seen online. Uh, we did get the drone up just as soon as we got here, we threw it up because the lighting was quite nice. Uh, but we were quickly told that you cannot film, uh, well you cannot fly a drone in this area. So we brought the drone down and we were still really happy with the footage we got. So woo! <laughs> But yeah, we're gonna go inside. It was actually a six pounds admission free. Uh, we're gonna go inside and see what it's like in there. Woo! To Cavalarock. How do you say it, Dean? Shout it. Kilaverock. Kilaverock. A little Kilaverock Castle. You know I'm bad at pronouncing names. Look how cool it is. Ooh. So that's us about to head into Kilaverock Castle. Uh, like you can see down here, like. Look, if you look over here, you can see the moat that's actually around it. This used to be manned by only like 60 people back in the day, uh, back in the 13th century when it was actually built, and there would be like thousands of men coming to try and get, like take over this castle pretty much. Uh, but just with only 60 people, they managed to actually withstand the attacks. This place is pretty cool. So peaceful. No wonder they didn't want us flying a drone. <laughs> like, just ruined the full vibe of the place. I bet when we were flying a drone over here, it was like. <laughs> The round tower to your left contained a grim pit prison. It was a holding cell for Murdoch, Duke of Albany before his execution in 1425. Well, that is dark. It's very dark. No do. So this is a prison? The pit prison? Do you think they used to throw people in? From up there, maybe? Back in the day. Right, so today we had a plan to kind of head here and uh, we weren't sure kind of how big this place was. We're starting here and we've got another location, an actual abandoned location, because this is this is abandoned, but it's like, obviously it's a castle, so it's like a kind of touristy attraction type thing. But we've actually got an abandoned building that we're going to go to that's kind of like in the middle of a forest. Looks pretty cool. Uh, we're going to head there in a bit. We're going to get a few pictures around about here. There is some kind of cool structures still left in this place. It is a very, it's very, very cool from the sky. Pretty much the drone shots did look sick. But actually for being inside, there's actually not nothing really much left in here. It's been abandoned for hundreds of years. It's a really, it is a really cool stru structure and so much history into it as well. I'll put a link down in the description, uh, like a uh, website with some information actually about this place if you do want to know a bit more. Back wall over there has actually been totally totally destroyed at some point. You can probably see it down here. See all that, it's totally destroyed. It's actually such a beautiful area. I wish we could have got more time with the drone to be honest because there was, there was so much more we could probably have captured in this area. Uh, but we did get, we got the full, we've got the full castle in and blah blah. We'll just have to make do with what we got. But yeah, I'm gonna get walk about now and get some kind of B-roll cinematic footage for you guys to enjoy. Then we're gonna head back to the car and head to another abandoned location today. So, see you in a bit. About nothing, why won't you go get you a dollar or something? Don't hang with a who line for nothing. I see that we different, you riding, I double my don't do discussions, don't bragging about hundreds. Don't go to your places, I know that they sunken. Don't call me your brother, I barely could trust you. I talk to a shorty, she bagging the bucket. And I'ma need all of my dollars on corporate, so hand me the money, I did be the buy. I'ma give all of my people a portion to build them a fortune, I'm flipping the vibe. I can't be mixy when if he the vibe. And 40 on 50 is still the time. Why is you all on my phone like you want me? Like you wasn't pushing the kick to the sound. Right guys, we've made it to this location, this abandoned um, house. So this kind of looks as if it was a farmhouse, I'm guessing, of some kind. Um, I'll just make sure my lens is open. Just have a wee kind of look about her. Just have a wee look in here. Looks like it used to be a wee kitchen. So halfway through the floor is totally, totally destroyed. God, I don't know if I can walk on this. I 
don't know where Dean is. Here he is out there. This actually looks pretty new. The stone looks... Strange. God knows. Hmm, let's see if we can get upstairs. Ooh, I don't know about this. <laughs> That's wood. Which is never a good idea. Oh, it's all, it's all destroyed anyway. The floor. Definitely not taking that jump. <laughs> no, no thanks. Here. What is this? A jail cell? <laughs> it's pure like it, isn't it? Strange man. Pigs or something, nah? Yeah, maybe. The floor would have been built up, will it, Giants? Hmm. Hmm. Goats. Chickens. <laughs> maybe chickens. Chicken. Maybe chickens, I suppose. Hmm. That's the kind of stuff that you usually get on top of chicken things, isn't it? Like that kind of barbed wire stuff. Stop them from kind of flying away. Chicken wire? Well, I mean, that would that would prove it. If that's the name of it. Look at that roof, man. Oh, is that the upstairs? That big bit, man. That looks dodgy. It looks as if it's about to collapse. Wow. Right, my camera actually died there. Um, so I had to run back to the car. And get another battery. So, where were we? Hmm, there's a road, there's a pheasant. You see that? Oh. Looks like they were doing something here at one point. Hmm. Or maybe still are. So it's definitely a road, so... Mere stairs. Do feel a bit sturdy up. Definitely not. Right, well.
Well, I thought that was quite a successful day. The only thing that sucked was being at that uh, castle earlier and then getting in trouble for using the drone. We did get some cool shots on it anyway, but I would have liked a bit more time because it was a very... We were wanting to go there pretty much for the drone shots. Um, so only being able to get like five minutes in the air was kind of rubbish because there was not a lot happening on the ground at the castle. But then we found this place and that kind of made up for it because it's an easy urban explore, was easy to get into. Uh, we can drive the car right up to it, <laughs> which is always a bonus. But as always, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to comment down below. Let us know down in the comment section if there is anywhere in Scotland you would like us to visit. We'll be sure to check it out. But until we see you next time, bye bye. <laughs>